Okay. Even the score, very important. This is going to be a rough match. It's not even going to be easy at all. So let me try the Odekin again because I feel like the position I got was pretty good. Yeah, this was a bad game. I mean, I mean, I had a good position, but okay. Let's see. E4. He goes knight of six. I, I will take and let's go bishop d3. Castle, rook e1. Let's see what he's going to do. He's playing very fast, so it should be a bit faster, I think. Goes with the bishop to a different square this time. But I'm not convinced by this either. Um, I got c5, takes, I got knight b4. Okay, let me just go knight d7, play. More or less normally. Yeah, now I'll go c5 when I still have the chance. So let's see. Knight d3, knight d7, knight f3. You cannot go c5. Okay, he goes for it. c4, knight d4, d5. Okay, I will play this. Yeah, he can do this, but I'm le at least I'm getting his bishop. Should play this. So, he's going to take, he has two bishops. I have space advantage, so we will see. Take, or I can also go b5. Let me just go b5, actually. Bishop b4, I got knight of 6 no d6 shenanigans. If he moves the bishop, I got bc. A3, I always have knight d3. Um, okay, yeah, let me let me play knight f6. You will see. Um, knight c3. It's going to take and go knight b6. I mean, bishop e4 maybe? Okay, let's go e3. Takes, I take on b4. Because bishop f5, then I have g4. It's always trying to be very tricky. Oh, I missed something. I thought about takes, rook e4, then bishop f5. That doesn't work. He can still. You can just go A B immediately. Okay. So I got to do this instead. Knight D six, I suppose. Takes Knight C four. I don't. I don't like it too much, but I didn't feel like I had a lot of choice. If he goes Knight A six, then I take and Knight C three. Or take and d6 maybe. Probably that works. Okay, let's see if he goes bishop f5. Or maybe he goes just knight d6 and knight c4. And play against those pawns. Okay. So, what can I do here? I need a strong move. Obviously, he's got a, he's got a pretty fearsome set of pawns on, on um, d5 and c5, but they can also be a bit loose. And um, I have a little bit of an, an initiative at the moment, so let's see if I can use that to my advantage. So, Knight c3, b4, but okay, I will develop it. Knight a4, yeah, this is strange. I mean, what should I go? Bishop, f Bishop g5, b4. Bishop g5, f6, d6 takes queen d5, king h8.
Mm. Okay, let's put this guy here. For now. Maybe he comes to B6 or something. You probably should go knight e4, decentralize the knight. I know the b2 is hanging, but I don't think that's massively important. So he goes knight a4. That's a bit surprising. I could go e6 now, d6, bishop b7. Doesn't look too bad. Knight, a, knight on a4 can be very much out of play. Bishop g5 is very strong threat, so he has to play... He cannot play slow. So let's go d6. Okay. So bishop g5, he takes on f3, queen c1. Yeah, let's do it. If he goes d6, I got bishop b6, should be fine. So he got, he got two connected passers, but I feel like all of my pieces are, are doing pretty well at the moment. So I don't think this should be clear at all. So did he miss bishop f3, or is he trying to trick me somehow? Bishop f3, queen c1, that must be the point. I don't think I can refute that. That's really annoying if he just locked into a good blunder. Now he's going to go b3 next. Hmm. I'm not sure if it's good, but... Bishop f3, queen c1, f6, gf3. Then I have those two pawns, which is very strong. We'll see, now he has to calculate. Okay, I gotta play. I gotta play faster. So GF, I'm gonna go knight d6, but I'm not. I'm not liking it too much. And if queen c1, bishop f6, I take and go queen c4, queen g5, g3. I mean, it's fine. I don't know who's better, but it is fine probably. So let's see. If he goes f6, then I go bishop h4. At least I have time advantage here. So, okay, he takes queen c1. He goes f6. So now which one should I take? I should take this. Oh, he took on d6. Okay. I missed this one. So, um, can I go queen c4? Queen d6, rook e6, queen f4. Hmm. Okay, I should take queen d2 or queen d1. Probably queen d1. But I'm hoping the fact that his knight could still be some way out of joining the game could swing the the balance in my favor but yeah as i said not liking it too much yeah so queen f5 trying to keep his queen from getting to d5 which i could think could have been pretty bad news for me okay queen, king h8 obviously queen f5 i think d7 i go rook d8 i also got g4 Potentially coming up. Yeah, queen d5, quite sensibly. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have time to think. Yeah, queen f4, I want to go g4 next. But like I have to create that kind of play. Queen c7. Okay, now I'm gonna add. Yeah, I should not, I should not take him probably. This was just really bad. Okay, trying to prevent knights. C5 at the very least. Now I think 
my position is sort of okay, but I'm losing on time. That's okay. Yeah. Still got knight b6, rook f6. Sort of. Mm. I'm losing on time. That's the problem. Yeah. Okay. Position got too too complicated. 